I'm gonna show you how to dip dye and stud a corset. Oh la la. <laughs> you are gonna need a white corset, fabric dye, butter knife, trash bags, plastic tablecloth or drop cloth, sponges, rubber gloves, and studs. First thing you have to do is set up your workstation and get your dye ready. I'm gonna be dyeing the laces separate, so remove, soak, and saturate, and then put into a trash bag and tie it closed. Because my corset isn't 100% cotton, the dye I'm using will end up being really subtle. It won't really set in. So I'm gonna put teal on the bottom half and black on the top half. Make sure you blend them together so your edge is more jagged and not straight across. You want it to look cool. Then put each panel into a separate trash bag, tie it closed, and wait six to eight hours. They're ready to rinse. Use warm water and rinse off the laces in the panels until the water runs clear. Then put them into delicate bags and add a little soap and wash the suckers and then lay them out to dry. Put the two panels back together and now you're ready for studs. I didn't go in with a set pattern. I just knew that I wanted to stud every other fabric section between the bones. It is really important that you bend the stud prongs flat and then back in towards the fabric because you don't want them stabbing you while you're wearing the corset. And I am dun dun done. Oh, it turned out so nice. I like it so much. It's so cool. I just love it. I love it. I am doing a giveaway because I feel like it and I think it'll be fun. So I'm going to pick one person and I will dip dye and stud it in your size. And all you got to do if you want to enter to win is click thumbs up and favorite this video and leave me a comment or video response um, giving me a virtual bribe. Yeah, like I will do your laundry for the next 10 years or I will marry you, <laughs> whatever, and I will pick someone to win. I love you guys so much, and bye, 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 bye. The corset's waving bye.